Hey Doug, this is Ryan here at G-Force. Just gonna go over your Honda with you. I'm gonna get them plugs out for you on the service. Do look a little brown. You can see a little dark, so we'll go ahead and replace those for you. I'm gonna get that oil draining. Also got your final drive oil draining. Uh, and I got your clutch lever off. It was all you can see. You can see right there. It's all it was all rusted and seized on there. So we'll go ahead and get that all cleaned up and lubed up for you, along with that clutch cable. <clears throat> Went ahead and pulled your brake lever off. This one wasn't near as seized. It was still pretty pretty nasty in there. We'll go ahead and clean that one up for you too, along with lubing up those throttle cables for you. Again, here's your plugs on the on the other side. Not too bad. Uh, they got me a tire. They said you wanted to do a tire, so we got to get a front tire put on this thing for you. Checking the front brake pads. Uh, they're probably 45, 50-ish percent left, so it's not bad. Forks those look good. They don't. Uh, actually, let's see. Hold on. Let me look here. I feel a little bit on the back. On the front, they look clean, but if you look at the back right here, actually, you can see right there. Oh, I'm gonna flash down here. It's kind of hard to see with their glare here, but you can look. Basically, you kind of it's right. You can kind of see all this right around in there. That's all forks so that's leaking right there. You can see along with the other side too. You can see a little better here. A little, it's a little hard with the glare, but same way, it's a, the fork seals are starting to leak. But they actually look like they've probably been leaking for a little while. Not not bad yet, because it doesn't cover your fork tube or anything like that. So you caught them in time where it said we can get them replaced for you. When, when I checked your rear tire pressure, I did notice it only had 10 PSI in it. So I started looking, and you can see right here, right there, you do have a nail in it, and it is leaking out of there. You can see it's bubbling out of there. I sprayed it and it's bubbling. And that's what's causing you to have basically low tire pressure because you only had 10 pounds in there. So we'll go ahead and get you a quote on getting a new new tire put on this thing. Get you six to finish up with your service here. Get your quote on new tire. Get your quote on the fork seals. But like I said, everything else looks good. I don't see I don't see any oil leaks or anything like that. So that's good. I did go ahead and bump up that, the idle for you. The idle was a little low, so I went and bumped that up for you. Also adjusted your rear brake pedal it was going down pretty far it was pushing all the way down to like here and so i made that so it's a little bit tighter for you so it doesn't have to push so far so like i said we'll get you a quote on the fork seals the rear tire and get the service finished up for you get the front tire put on for you and get you out of here thanks have a good day